Leanna Stark was Eddard Stark's younger and only sister, and has been deceased for 14 years at the beginning of A Game of Thrones, but is mentioned in every published book in the series. She died at the young age of 16, was said to have been very beautiful by all who knew her as, a child woman of surpassing loveliness, and, a wild beauty. She was also remembered as being headstrong and, had a touch of, the fabled Starks, wolf blood, and was one of the best horse riders in the north. She was betrothed to Robert Baratheon, who was deeply in love with her, although she was unimpressed by Robert's reputation for infidelity. Her life's tales are mainly told through the words of Eddard Stark and Mira Reed, via Bran Stark's viewpoint chapter, with some passing commentaries from other people such as Barristan Selmy, Cersei Lannister, Roose Bolton and Kevin Lannister. During the tourney at Harrenhal, the greatest tourney in Westerosi history, Lyanna rescued Stark Bannerman Howland Reed by beating away three bullying squires. She was later chosen by the eventual jousting champion, Crown Prince Rhaegar Targaryen, as the tourney's Queen of Love and Beauty. Because Rhaegar was already married, and Lyanna was a maiden betrothed to Robert Baratheon, Rhaegar's wooing of Lyanna was considered an outrageous scandal at the time. One year later, she was said to have been abducted and raped by Rhaegar, triggering a civil war that resulted in the overthrow of House Targaryen. At the end of the war, Eddard and six of his companions ventured to the Tower of Joy within Dawn, where Lyanna was located and guarded by three of the most prominent Kingsguard knights, the Sword of the Morning, Sir Arthur Dane, Sir Oswell Went, and the White Bull, Sir Gerald Hightower, Lord Commander of the Kingsguard. After a fierce skirmish that killed everyone except Eddard and Howland, Eddard entered the tower and found Lyanna dying in a bed of blood. Before she died, she asked her brother Eddard to make a promise, something that Eddard regarded as a price he paid that haunted him days and nights for 14 years.